Who's that? Girl in the uniform. I've already checked here. He's not in the general store either. Who's she looking for? Damn, where could he be? Get a move on, Joshua. Whoa, Estelle. Watch where you're going or... Oh! Ow! Uh, I'm sorry, are you okay? Wasn't paying attention to where I was going and... No, no, it's alright. Pardon me, I confess. My attention was elsewhere as well. Oh, okay. So I guess we're even. What? That's not how this works. I swear, Estelle, what are you doing? What's wrong? N nothing. There's something going on here. I'm sorry if she disturbed you. You're not hurt, I hope. No, I'm fine. I was looking for someone, and I wasn't watching where I was going. Oh, who are you looking for? A little boy, about ten years old, wearing a cap. I don't suppose you've seen him, by any chance. Have we... I don't think we've seen a boy wearing a cap. A boy in a cap. You see anyone like that, Joshua? Not that I can go call. No. I see. Where could he be? Do excuse me. Sorry to have caused you any trouble. I feel like she's going to be important. She kind of looks... She, she looks a little, a little bit basic, basic though, like appearance-wise, but... She looks like she she's going to be important. Joshua. Hello, calling Joshua. Come in. Joshua. Oh, uh, what is it? Gee, I wonder. Like, maybe the, it's the uniform. Maybe he recognizes the uniform. I see what's going- Wow, that's not it. Oh, what half-baked idea are you cooking up this time? Now, now, no need to be shy about it. I see the way she set your heart aflutter. Absolutely not. I just think I've met her before, a long time ago. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was just surprised. Hmm, met her before, you say. As pickup lines go, I give it 30 points. Moving on, don't you recognize her uniform? Now that you mention it, isn't that the same outfit that Josette uses as disguise? Was it? Yeah, the Jinnishwara Academy uniform. Since we're here in Ruan, it's not all that surprising to see someone wearing one. Ah, so that's the real thing. She seemed polite and smart and refined. Totally different from that scruffy, crude pretender, in other words. What are you talking about? Josette had you completely fooled from the get-go. Oh, that's right. You teased me about it then, too. Well, if you get taken for a fool again, don't expect me to help you. Instead of picking on me, why not work on becoming a better judge of character? All right, all right. Fine, I won't pick on you anymore. Good. Oh, that's the boy! Today must be my day for just randomly running into people. Sorry about that. I'm just looking for somebody. Say, you're not from around here, are you? Nope, we're from out of town. Hey, aren't you? What? We ran into a girl who said she was looking for a boy who was wearing a cap. You know anything about that? Oh, I'm looking for her, actually. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Where'd you see her? <laughs> I'm not going to do voice acting. Over by the tavern. It was a while ago, though. I'm not sure where she went. Would you like us to help you search? No, that's okay. I'm pretty sure I can find her. Okay, bye. Dude, this kid is hyper. That kid seems pretty energetic. He reminds me a little of Luke back in Roland. Wonder what the kids are up to now. It'd be cool if we could, like, go back to Roland right now. What's wrong? It might just be my imagination, but have you lost anything? Lost what? Did the kid jack it from us? Anything you're wearing? Like a money pouch or something? Why are you asking all of a sudden? Let's see. Pouch, check. If I lose all my money here, I'm gonna be pissed. Hairbands, check. Bracer emblem. I knew it. What the? Where is it? Did I drop it on the mountain pass or something? Calm down. I remember that you had it when we were eating lunch. If you lost it, it has to be somewhere around here. But where should I? But where around here? Oh, no way. Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. It was probably that kid. I'll bet it happened when he accidentally ran into you. What? Why would he want my bracer emblem? What reason does this kid have for wanting anything? Probably just took it because he could. Oh, he is in so much trouble. Once I get my hands on him, he's going to get the spanking of his life. Spanking of his life? <laughs> no, calm down, Mama. Mommy, Estelle. For now, let's focus on figuring out where he is. I swear. Clem, where did you go? Miss Chloe is going to be worried about you. Ha! <laughs> no, she won't. Not after I show her the awesome thing I got. 
What'd you get, Clem? Ha <laughs> ha! Now don't freak out or anything. I just borrowed it from the crazy lady I ran into. Who are you calling crazy? What? Ah! What are you doing here? Hmm, I'm a bracer. Give me a little credit. Wherever a delinquent like you goes, we'll figure it out in no time. Damn it. Well, you're not catching me. Hey, get back here. I got a hip hop. A hippie to hop, a run, run, one, and a dash, and a dash, and a ziggity zag, and a whack up a bam and I get away from Estelle because she's kind of slow. Hey, mister, what's going on? Did Clem die? <laughs> They're running in the background! What? Did Clem do anything, something bad again? I'm sorry to barge in like this. Damn it! Let go! Let me go! I'll sue you for child abuse. You're a real brat, you know that? Now give me back my emblem. You got no proof I took it. Well, you're right on that one. That's nothing a quick search won't fix. Yeah! <laughs> hey, get it out. That tickles. Pervert. Abuse! Come on. Just give it up and hand over what you took. Sig. What? There was a bird that just thwacked her in the head. What the hell was that? Oh. Is that her bird? Get away from the boy. Lay another hand on him. On you, I have me to con. Huh? Hey, you're that. I remember you from Minoria. <laughs> so it's a cure falcon. Help me, Miss Chloe. Is it Chloe or Chloe? I think it's Chloe. Or is it is it Chloe? I don't know. I didn't do anything, and she's being mean to me. Didn't do anything. My butt. You stole my emblem. <laughs> So where's your proof? <laughs> and no tickling this time! Mm. Dude, I feel like Estelle's always growling. Hey, we meet again. Oh, hello. I'm sorry, I thought for sure that a thief had broken in. I assume there's a reason for all this. There... There sure is, Miss Chloe. Oh, tattleteller! Clem was being bad again. Hey, is the apple pie ready yet? You have to wait a little longer. It still needs time to bake. You freaking brat! Child abuser! What are you gonna grow up, Clem? Is the pie done yet? <laughs> Danny was just like, I'm hungry. This has gotten out of hand. Oh, haha. -ha. Yes, I suppose it has. <laughs> My, what's all the noise? Matron Ther Teresa. Or is it Matron or Matron? Matron? Teresa? I don't know the full story, but it sounds like Clem's been up to no good. Hey, no fair, I didn't do anything. The pervert lady just says I did. Who you calling a pervert? Oh dear, this won't do. Clem, did you really not do anything? Of course not. Do you swear to Adios? I, I swear? I see. It's just that you dropped some kind of badge in the nursery earlier. That wasn't yours, was it? But, but but it was in my pants pocket. Uh, I told you. Oh my. Nicely done. Clem, no more excuses. Give her back what you stole. Dude, kid swore on Adios. All right. All right. I'll give it back. So just drop it. Clem tossed the emblem over to Estelle. Whoa. Hey, I'm out of here. Dude, that kid, Clem. It's all right. He'll be back when he starts getting cold. More to the point. Why is everyone standing around? Why don't you tell me the whole story over a cup of tea? 